Hello, I'm Gatlin Button, Field Specialist in Agronomy with MU Extension, and today we'll talk about the identification of switchgrass. Switchgrass is a common native warm season species that's being included in more pasture mixes and planted alone for hay and forage crops. Switchgrass is one of our earlier warm season species. We're in the end of July now, and we see we already have seed heads out, we already have seed being produced on these. This one is going to be a little bit more aggressive than some of our other species, so when planted in a mix, we probably need to reduce that seeding rate. When we're planted alone, we can maintain it as a good, solid stand of switchgrass. One way to tell the difference between this and our others is just how open this seed head is. This is a very stereotypical panic-type seed head. We'll see this on all of the panic-type grasses, where we have an open seed head, have these arching limbs on it, and we have seed produced throughout. On this particular one, we see that we have a lot of smooth, smaller seeds. This is very indicative of switchgrass. One other way to tell the difference is where the leaves meet the stalk. We have two things to look at there. The leaf sheath on switchgrass forms a distinctive V shape as it goes down and wraps around the stem. We'll also notice that we have many short hairs on the leaf sheath. In addition, the ligule of switchgrass is membranous and covered in fine hairs. We see that we have a dense pubescence here on the lower third of the leaf. As we go up, the hairs become finer and thinner until we get to the end of the leaf where we are mostly smooth. If you have questions about identifying or using native grasses, please contact your local extension office.